So you finally finished all the animations and you need to get them off Blender and into Unity 3D but you have no idea what these settings mean or which ones you need. Not a problem, in the next 60 seconds you will know everything you need in order to get your beautiful animations into the world of game design. Alright, let's do this. First thing, shift select all the meshes you want to export and press Control A and click scale to apply the proper scale to your object. Then shift select your armature so that it's the last thing that you've selected. Then go to the bottom where it says end and make sure that whatever number this is is larger than the total length of all the animations that you want to export. Now go to file, export, FBX, and you're gonna have to change a few settings, but be really careful and pay close attention here or else it's not gonna work. In the main tab, make sure that you uncheck active collection and pick selected objects only. Remind Blender that forwards is forwards and not Z backwards. Click Armat and shift click mesh. Game developing engines usually have their own cameras and lamps so don't bring those from Blender. In the geometry tab you can apply modifiers if you have them and in the armature tab make sure you uncheck add leaf bones. They're completely useless and waste a lot of space in game design so make sure they're not checked. In the animation tab, take off NLA strips and in my experience you should also uncheck force start and keying. Select the location you want to export, probably your Unity asset folder, and click export FBX. You're done. And now if we go to Unity and click on our FBX file under animations, drag this up here, you can see that the character has survived the trip with all of her animations intact and ready to go. If your character has texture maps, make sure you drag those into the assets folder too. You might have to create materials for those textures and then drag those materials onto your model, but you're gonna do that in Unity, not Blender. Hope that helps. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. As always, hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you around.